All right, guys, we are back. Now, I do apologize for technical difficulties, and I really hope that all is well to begin round three here. Now, yes, we did have some tech, uh, technical difficulties to get things started here. So guys, I do apologize for that. And of course, guys, holy smokes, these uh, comments must be carrying over from the previous stream there. Uh, but Savage, uh, sh sorry, Shishkabobber, Shishkabobber, thank you uh, for complimenting the thumbnail. Uh, Alex Jones, what's up, Alex Jones? Yes, I finally made it to a stream. Uh, we've been having some major technical difficulties getting this stream up and going uh, with very poor internet connection. Uh, I've actually just finished restarting uh, my modem, guys. Taking a deep breath here as well. Like I said, fingers crossed. And Danny boy, what is up? Uh, this is not the start that I wanted uh, to have for the Oz Domination 25-man All Hits Live special. So guys, we already skipped. Oh, please don't say that, Rudy. But if it does, it does. And unfortunately, that's just the way it is. Uh, but guys, we are going to go back and show some of the replays in just a moment here. So uh, we're going to follow up with Devil right now, a.k.a. VA. VA is not taking any time to waste here. Jumping right in to 159 Force Point Titan. This is beautiful, guys. I love this. Now, I told the fellas as well when I was restarting the modem that if anybody did have to hit uh, just due to time zones, uh, and of course for the Aussies, I do believe it's very early and some of them are trying to go to bed, so we did try to time it out where some of them would be able to hit first and just make it safe and easy for everyone. Josh R, it's like 3, 4 a.m. for VA right now. VA is an absolute trooper. And Alex Jones, no worries. That's exactly what I'm saying with the different time zones. Uh, but guys, look at this hit right now from VA. Nice direct flare on the MG to the top right here. You are going to see a reflare to the core in just a second here. And I'm pretty sure we did see brick in there, not bullets. So this is going to get interesting. Wow! That is brave. I can't believe he brought Brick with him, firing off that battle orders with all those machine guns and flamethrowers up top. I mean, that's just splash damage central right there. Anything is possible. Let's see what the fellas are saying in the TF chat right now. And it looks like, uh-oh. I hope we are not skipping again. This is just awful. And the delay... Sorry, not for me. Uh, yeah, I should be good by then, ads. Uh, if he's live, I don't have to. Uh, just hit devil. No need. That's right, guys, because it is 3, 4 a.m., so that is crazy that he just hit right now. Nice, bro. LMAO. Major's loving it as well. So, guys, big shout-out right there to Devil, a.k.a. VA, taking it to Titan right there uh, because of delay of stream. No worry, Devil. We were going to go back in and watch uh, the previous hit. Clash fan, fingers crossed that it works better now. The internet is still a little bit choppy here, still a, li a little bit unpredictable, uh, but yes, the show must go on. So big shout out, of course, once again to VA, to Josh, and to Ads, because of course they are the ones that organized this. This was about, I think, three or four days in the making here. Uh, you booming at 3 a.m. every day. Another stream skull. Absolutely, we started another one. You guys are killing me right now. I, I love this, guys. All right, it's two minutes and we are live. That's right, we are already live right now, so no point for that one. Guys, we're going to go back in and actually watch the very first hit here from Mr. Boss, AKA Boss Beach here. And this was the cooker ring right here. And I think a few people actually did mention that this was actually a valiant effort or a very good attempt on that cooker ring. So I like that Boss Beach is taking a beautiful left flare approach here, guys. Nice coverage though. The delay has been lost already. So Mr. Boss is gonna have to be super careful here. For those of you that did catch glimpses of this attack, for, oh my god, the mines. That's what happened there, guys. Absolutely brutal. Nonetheless, though, he did get his Zookas into position here. Battle orders being fired off. And was successful in taking out a handful of rocket launchers here. We've got the second one going down right now. But that is not it there for boss, guys. He was finished. 
And Savage, I'm not sure if that's ouch because of the mines or ouch because of the stream cutting out, but I guess it could definitely relate to either or, my friend. And still going in with two more boats of Zookas on the right side. And Mega Gamer, I don't know how people take these bases down. Hours of practice and attacking, that's exactly what it is, man. Savage is like, ouch, the mine. Okay, so it looks like that we are still working, guys, up and going. Happy to hear that. Let me know how the stream is looking on your end here. Remember, guys, we are watching the replay from Boss Beach here. Nice job getting the Zookas inside the safe zone of the RLs there. Very dangerous having the flamethrowers and that MG there. I love it. Adds pretty much hours and hours. Absolutely, guys. There's no giving up. And especially if you're committed and you're dedicated, you will keep on hitting and you will be persistent in your attacks, meaning that you will fail a whole bunch before. And Clash Fan is letting me know it is freezing again. Zombie Pigman, what is up, man? Welcome, welcome. Uh, next hitter. We may still be lagging i can't even no commander of the month right now i do apologize gunner girl was mentioning that so guys like i said once again let me know how the stream is looking on your end there this is a 25 man tf special oz domination taking on forlorn hope and we've just been cutting out okay so at least no, this is bad, guys. It's just cutting up and going, cutting up and going. LOL, I have to start in the op in Commander of the Month soon. That's right, guys. We will be cutting it short here. So next attacker may step up. Next attacker when ready. For those of you that have stuck with me through the miserable skipping and lagging of the start of this, guys. I do sincerely apologize. I want to thank you all so much for the commitment, for the loyalty, guys. Not a good start, but the show will go on. And that's right, guys. There is Commander of the Month, I do believe, going on at 5 p.m. as well. And looks like our next three hitters are going to be Sacco, Bay's Beach, and Sir Brown. Clash fan, the weather is absolutely awful for me right now. The weather is, it, it's bad, man. There's snow and ice pretty much everywhere. Luckily, it's not snowing right now, so, but there is snow everywhere. Art McHenry, what is up, Art? Welcome to the live stream, guys. Show some love. We've got an Art McHenry sighting in the YouTube chat. And all right, guys, we are jumping right in with Sacco Varmit's attack. Here we go. I like this, guys. Going into 205 Javanese right here, dropping two boats of Zookas on the left side of the beach, guys. We've got easy power cells for the farming here. I think he once he does actually take advantage of those five power cells, we are going to see a reflare to the right side of the beach here. Half the Ozdom guys are the last six hitters, so probably won't get a hit. Oh my god. Well, you know what, Ads? If we've got to switch anything up, and if we've got to throw these guys in so they can hit a little bit earlier, I am totally okay with that. Like I said, I just want to apologize for the technical difficulties that we've had to get this stream up and going, especially for those of you that it's 3, 4, 5 a.m., and for those of you that are participating in Cotton, our commander of the month which is today as well at 5 p.m. Sacco nice job regrouping the Zookas guys we are going for a direct reflare to the right side of the beach right now give him a second here because he did actually farm an additional one two three four five six seven 21 more gunboat energy and of course with our gunboat energy boost from the tribal boost he's actually putting himself in a very very good position to pull off this solo hell's queen what is up guys we've got an hq sighting andy my man welcome to the live stream all good skull no worries way to get it straight bro base we've got to stay committed man the show must go on like i said technical difficulties hasn't happened in a while uh but in the early days when i started streaming oh my god it was like every other stream was just cutting out for me uh but guys very happy that we are up and going now and once again let's focus our attention back on sacco varmint right now getting brick in those zookas whoa watch the delay 
Oh my god, okay, the delay has been lost. Brick is severely damaged right now, but Sacco getting the troops into position in the KZ. Reflare to the core. Man, he's got to shock those shock launchers, machine guns, and rocket launchers. Let's follow up with the critter box directly on those boom cannons. Look at this guy go. I'm telling you guys, cycles another shock, pins down the MGs. And what's left of the shock launchers, he is still going. Does he have enough to finish this off? Wow, guys, I was really expecting that to go down right there. I feel like he got robbed at the very end there. Boom goes the dynamite. He's getting a boom goes the dynamite from me. Absolutely beautiful right there. Uh, fine. Worry about Commander of the Month Skull Crusher. All good. They're 50. Thanks, man. No worries. I just realized Gunner Girl, uh, I'm sorry, like I said, with technical difficulties. Now we've started about 35 minutes later than we were initially supposed to, uh, but no worries. How many hit points does it have left? We're about to go back in and check out. That was a beautiful hit right there, guys. Show some love in the YouTube chat. 50. Robbed is right. We call that a special, an EF X25, 97,165 hit points left on that power core, everybody. Excellent job right there from Sacco. Holy smokes, guys. I got to show some love. Sacco, well, oh, that's Salo. I want Sacco. Well done. Oh, we got the next attacker going in. I love this, guys. No time to waste. Base Beach jumping right in. Two, 189 Chimera. Whoa, this is only a 189 Force Point. Could definitely be a lot worse than that. Starting off with Bullet and the Zookas, guys, and he is taking... Oh my god, guys, we got Bay's Beach taking a direct approach up the middle here on Chimera. And Capone, is that a Capone sighting in the YouTube chat? Oh, oh, that's Andy. Andy talking about Capone. Nonetheless, guys, big shout out to Elite Force EF in the house right now. Whew, Clash fan, fingers crossed. Let's not jinx it. We're jumping into the next attacker right now, which is Bay's Beach. And I love this up the middle approach on Chimera. Tons of RLs all over the place. We should see Bullet being shocked and a reflare to, of the Zookas to the left side of the core here. Guys, we are going for a repositioning. He's got to be quick here and reflare the core. The delay's been lost. As long as those RLs keep firing on Bullet, and I'm hoping Baze has got enough to recycle a shock here on those same RLs, and yes, he does. Holy crap, guys. Oh my god, he missed the one rocket launcher with the shock. I feel like the last two hitters have been absolutely robbed here. And just like that, guys, it was that one rocket launcher right there that that last shock that Baze cycled missed. Baze Beach... Valiant effort, my friend. That was a beautiful hit. Holy crap, guys. Let's show some love to Bay's Beach for that phenomenal job right there. Taking on four Lauren Hope's Chimera. Look at the fellas in the TF chat right now. Awesome effort, Bays. Good job, Bays. Nice Bays and Kato. Damn, nice Bays. Good job, Bays. Good job, Bays. Thanks, guys. Unlucky with the delay. Would have dropped it 100%, guys. We got ads as well following up. Next three hitters are going to be Sir Brown, Major Azul. Shout out to the Major, guys. All hits live. Original Golden Zuka champion. And Captain 50, guys. That was awesome. I got to show Bays some love right there. Bays, that was beautiful, my friend. And happy we caught that one live as well with as minimal lag as possible. Once again, for everybody joining us right now, uh, we are doing a task force special. This is an event as well with Oz Domination. Big shout out to Ads, to Josh, and of course the VA for organizing this, making it possible. Once again, I do apologize for the technical difficulties to get things up and going. Vanessa Vasquez, what is up Vanessa? Welcome, big shout out to you. I am just as happy that we've got this stream up and going everybody and looks like the next attacker is going to be sir brown once again everybody show some love to bays cooker is fun ransom and phobos bays beach is like thanks skull not a problem man way to put on a good show for us and remember guys big shout out to the aussies and the 25 man event task force oz domination i i, I love this guys once again going directly to the tf description 
all hits live with Skull Crusher for Lauren Hope, fully boosted Friday, February the 8th, 2019 at 4 p.m. U.S. Eastern Standard Time. Contact at Josh R at Ozdom on Telegram. Remember, guys, do not forget to download Telegram today. Drop that Gunner Girl command, exclamation mark, Gunner Girl. And in the YouTube chat, no worries, Skull. Thanks for the stream. VA, nothing but love for you, man. I love your, your commitment to the game as well. The fact that you are staying up as late as you are, my friend, is if it is it, sorry, is it not 3, 4, or 5 a.m. Uh, where you are right now? Nonetheless, I love the commitment, guys. And we have got Sir Brown stepping up to the plate to ransom. How is he going to follow up after that beautiful Chimera hit done by the one and only Bay's Beach. And look at this, guys. We may be in for a bullet ransom core wrap. Sir Brown starting things off with a standard barrage, clearing mines around the core. This looks like a fairly easy ransom, though, in VA, 3.20 a.m. You are a champ, my friend. Big shout out to VA. Guys, show some love to VA in the YouTube chat. Uh, I haven't checked in the op yet, Andy. I love it, guys. We got Baby Gravy, a.k.a. Tango, in the YouTube chat. Nice job, guys. No need for a flare on the landing. And successfully dropped all eight boats of Zookas in two smokes. Unfortunately, a couple of the Zookas did run into a mine here. He's got to be careful here. His Zookas are already previously damaged from that earlier mine. A little bit of a gap here, which means that the, uh, sorry, the delay has already been lost. Still, uh-oh. Okay, not as serious as I thought. And guys, we've got brick, not bullet here. So we will not be seeing the bullet ransom core wrap here. As long as Sir Brown has enough shocks here to cycle on the shock launchers, rocket launchers, shock blasters, and he should be able to outrange these MGs up top, even though a few of the girls may be in range. Nice job on the shocks, man. Even gets the critter box up front. Will he have enough in him to finish this core off, guys? He's going. He's going. Enough gumboat energy to cycle two more shocks, pinning down the RLs and SLs. And just like that, as battle orders wears off, boom, goes the dynamite, guys. Valiant effort, a wonderful execution. Sir Brown putting on a clinic for us, guys. Holy crap. Ian Ritchie, my man. What is up, Ian? Welcome to the live stream. Big shout out to you, to Kate, to Nolan, and to Logan. Yo, shout out to the Ritchie clan. You know what's up, Ian. So happy to see you here. Happy Friday to you as well. I am off today, Ian. We are doing a Task Force special, streaming 25-man TF Oz Domination, taking on Forlorn Hope, and no time to waste, guys. We got Major Azul going right in to Manticore. I love the adrenaline right now in these hitters. Awesome hit, Jordy. Sir Brown. So Sir Brown, a.k.a. Jordy. Excellent hit, guys. Show some love to Jordy, a.k.a. Sir Brown, in the YouTube chat. I can't even go back up and follow up in the TF chat with the speed and the momentum that this is moving at right now. I love it. Okay, Major Azul dropping some standard artillery. Clearing mines. I like this VA. He's taking a up the middle approach, guys. I'm also a big fan of the right side approach here on Manticore. But honestly, guys, whatever floats your boat, and depending on the setup that you are working with, whoa, he gapped his smoke just a little bit. Flirting with those mortars. He's got to have to be careful here. Major Azul is coming right up to this boom mine in mine. Brick dancing right between the boom mine. Should get a beautiful two smoke drop at the end here. Now remember guys, Manticore is all about the timing with the critters to the left and to the right of the core before you cycle your shocks. We've got a direct reflare to the core, critters to the right, shocks coming to the right, middle and left. Battle orders activated. Come on Zookas, bring it down. Wow guys, I don't think Major Azul had enough gumboat energy to cycle a critter box on the left side of the core. He got the critters on the right side, but unfortunately, I don't think I did see anything on the left side there. Cheers, fellas. Not so clean, but job well done. And that is exactly from Sir Brown in the YouTube chat. Uh, the devil, this op gonna get smashed. 
Grab a count, nice hit major, nice hit bro. Just missed a flame two, nice work, HQ, 100%. Well said, and guys, show some love. We've got Hell's Queen in the YouTube chat. Holy smokes, guys, one solo so far. Sir Brown, aka Jordy, Jordy. Sir Brown, aka Jordy, putting on a clinic with that 173 ransom solo. Major Azul, not enough gumboat energy for critters. 3 GBE account. I keep forgetting that you were brave enough and brought in your crab account, Major. Wow. Guys, do not forget to drop that exclamation mark, Major, and show some love to Major Azul. Excellent hit. VA, I agree with you, my friend. Okay, guys, Captain 50 stepping up to the plate next. Manticora with 3 GBE ads says, which means... What did you just do? That is absolutely absurd. Uh, Skull, what do you think for the developers, worship developer update? Oh, I'm looking forward to it. Absolutely 100% looking forward to it. All right, guys, take a look at Captain 50's approach here to Minotaur. He's going to flare to the right side of the beach and then directly flare to the left side. And flaring his Zookas in that manner should actually put them out of range of the beach mortars entirely. Excellent job. Look at that. Just skinning the outside of that safe zone. We've got a direct reflare going. Uh oh. Oh my god. Captain 50 taking full advantage of that mortar delay. Not a big fan of, of, of flirting with the Zookas and mortars, but that was nicely executed by Captain 50. Reflaring bullet and the Zookas to mid flare point. And here we go, guys, directly taking them to the KZ, which, let's be honest here, on Minotaur is generally by the Building Health Masterpiece directly in front of the core. And wow, we've actually shocked Bullet in front of that Masterpiece, reflared our Zookas inside the second smoke drop, reflared the core, cycled the shock, pinned down the shock launchers. Taunt has been activated. Now, as long as Captain 50 has enough gumboat energy... To keep shocking those shock launchers, he might be able to pull this off, guys. And Captain 50 has just cycled the second shock. Does Captain 50 have enough gumboat energy in him to cycle a third shock? And yes, he does! Now, those mortars behind the core are starting to fire at those Zookas. Bullet is down. Rocket launchers have redirected their fire to the Zookas. Oh my god, guys. Holy smokes. We are going to go right into that Chimera finish right now. That was a brilliant... Brilliant attack right there. Show some love. And guys, no time to waste. Ultron jumping right in right now. Nice hit. Awesome 50. Nice cap. Unlucky 50. 50 definitely should have had that, guys. Let me know in the comments what you thought of Captain 50's attack right there. Definitely valiant effort, everybody. That's for sure. Okay, look at this, guys. We are going right back into Chimera right now. Big shout out to Ultron. And I'm liking the left side to middle approach here. Now, sometimes you might get some RLs over here and you'll deploy a couple boats of Zookas to take out those RLs. And then you've got a ton of power cells for farming. But Hell's Queen, well said on that one. I would have to agree with you. Guys, that was an excellent hit right there. Show some love to Captain 50. And I like this Ultron, no time to waste. Almirante Mata, what is up, my friend? Welcome, welcome, show some love. Nice job, guys. Shocking bullet directly in front of the core, reflaring the Zookas into the last smoke, shocking those RLs, reflaring the core, dropping that critter box as well. <claps> Ultron, guys. Oh my god, and even drops the barrage on his Zookas, adding to the Zooka casualty count that's what i'm talking about boom goes the dynamite show some love to ultron everybody finishing off chimera remember guys bay's beach started things off there and then of course ultron going in and finishing things off guys we've still 17 hitters remaining minotaur cooker phobos javanese manticore titan we've got ransom and chimera biting the dust already and chinese character name going right in to Cooker. I'm loving this madness, guys. I'm loving the energy. 
Ultron was unboosted as well. These guys just know, looking at this op, that, you know what, we could definitely pull this one off unboosted. Major Azul with the boom. This op is going down 100%. Okay, so this is Andy. Ads and VA are correcting me in the YouTube chat. That Chinese character name going up right now is Andy, guys. Big shout out to Andy right now. And let's get a much, much cleaner approach to this RL ring. Ultron's boost actually ran out. Oh my god, right prior to his attack, the boost ran out. Uh-oh, Andy's lost the delay. His shocks are going to have to be on point. And of course, his shocks are on point, guys. We got battle orders being fired off. Zooka's making very quick work of these RLs. Excellent smoke job, recovering the Zookas with smoke, reflaring to the next flare point. This should actually put all Zookas inside the safe zone of the four remaining rocket launchers. And he's got to be careful. He's got five MGs to the left of him that are going to rip him a new one here. Cycles the shock. He did miss one MG. He's got to be careful here. Come on, Andy. Yes! Okay, the Zookas have taken out the MG that was not shocked. Look at how fast the Zookas are going. Clearing rocket launchers and machine guns like it's nothing. One more MG to go, and then the rocket launcher ring, or the semi-rocket launcher ring, is down. Absolutely beautiful, guys. Look at that. No point to finish off the shield gens. That is additional gunboat energy for the core rush here. Let's drop that critter box and reflare to those cannons. Nicely done, Fritz's army. What's up, man? Welcome to the live stream, guys. We've got a Fritz's army sighting in the YouTube chat. What is up, Fritz? Show some love, guys. Boom Beach YouTuber, Fritz's army in the house. Hell's Queen, the pro open I expect from Andy. Well said on that one. He just made the most of that open. Still managing time and still managing gunboat energy like a boss. Guys, big hype, big shout out to Andy. Nightbot knows what's up, showing some love to VA. And look at this, guys. Two more boats of Zookas being deployed. That wasn't even a full Zooka deployment there. Awesome open. And Clash fan, do you have cats? I've got two cats, bro. Felix and Squanto. I, I love that. Andy didn't even deploy all eight boats of Zookas to clear that rocket launcher ring. It was only six boats of Zookas. Added the additional two boats of Zookas after the ring was cleared. Look at this guy go. One more MG to go, but that is making quick work of his Zookas. Single shot defenses, come on. Not a chance, guys. Brick is down. Nice job, guys. Andy, very unselfish, following up with the barrage. Clearing those mines in front of the flamethrower, setting up the shield gens. And of course, clearing the mines directly in front of the core as well. Absolutely beautiful. And guys, one more Zooka going to town on those power cells. Show some love to Andy. That's how you open Cooker. Now remember, guys, that was the second attack on Cooker, but that is how you approach Cooker, everybody. And Xerity, what is up, man? Welcome to the live stream. Big hype. Big shout out to you, my friend. Welcome. Welcome, VA. Awesome open, well said, fellas. Ads is like Fritz is in the chat, and Hell's Queen, very nice Andy. And holy crap, guys, Zombie Pigman Jr. jumping right into Phobos here. I love that name. This name is definitely got to be up there along the lines of Angry Bob Ross and Pickle Rick. So show some love, guys. We got Zombie Pigman Jr. going on. 227 force points on Phobos here. And look at this, guys, taking a left side approach. Catfish, what is up? Welcome to the live stream, guys. We have got a catfish sighting. Big shout out to you. And unfortunately, Clash fan, my cats are not in the room with me right now. So I will not be able to show you unless I leave my room. Um, and that's not happening right now, buddy. So maybe on another stream. You can see the cat on my cup. <laughs> All right, guys, look at that. And if you remember, Zombie Pigman did drop a barrage opening up those boom mines. Unfortunately, Brick did tag one of those boom mines as well. Always hungry for mines, guys. Always hungry for mines. Nice job getting Zookas and Brick into position. Reflare the core. We've got to have a laser, shock launchers, and rocket launchers to worry about. Holy crap. Excellent job here, guys. Zombie Pigman Jr. should have more than enough time for these Zookas to finish this core here as the shocks expire. 
absolutely beautiful. And look at that, guys. Even dropping the med kits on the Zookas. Zombie Pigman Jr. getting it done and getting it done like a boss, guys. 227 force points on a Phobos from Forlorn Hope. Not a chance, guys. That's what I'm talking about. 15 hits remaining, and this op is going quick, guys. We've got Minotaur, Cooker, Javanese hanging on by a thread, Manticore, and Titan as well. Beautiful, good, and nice attack, says Clash Fan. And look at this, guys. Ninja Turtle going... Uh-oh. Base is under attack. Whoops, I meant to go spectate. Holy smokes, guys. Ninja Turtle. Is this the turtle? Thanks, guys. Zombie Pigman, thank you, guys. Show some love to ZP. JR, Zombie Pigman Jr. And guys, Ninja Turtle stepping up to the plate next. Uh, I'm going to be honest with you guys. Ninja Turtle is taking a right side Manticore approach here. We did see Major Azul go right up the middle here. But if Ninja Turtle is going right side here, uh, I'm a big fan of right side Manticore approach. Big shout out to Talha. He did an excellent job with that uh, on, uh, on OG's stream from two days ago. And I actually followed up and actually finished it right after him. So I love this. Gaps the smoke because you can. I mean, you're looking at mortars and snipers. Your Zookas are moving at a quick enough pace that the, uh, the gap will not affect them. And Andy, no worries, man. Thank you so much for tuning in. Show some love to Andy in the YouTube chat, guys. What a beautiful, beautiful cooker hit. And once again, no Scorcher, pure Zooka. I love the confidence here, guys. Ninja Turtle, right side, Manticore approach here. Reflare to the KZ, two smoke drop. One smoke drop, nope. Sets up a one smoke, two. <clears throat> His two smoke drop. Reflares the core. Okay, this is not looking too bad. He's going to have to cycle a shock, drop a critter box. Oh my god, that one RL literally fired a smidge too early. Execution was on point here. And unfortunately, one of the shock launchers did fire off as well, completely roasting those Zookas right there. Holy smokes, guys. Valiant effort right there. Jumping right into Minotaur next. These guys really, really know how to show us to hit these bases. Holy crap, guys. Boom goes the dynamite on that one. Not even any time to follow up with them in the TF chat or the YouTube chat. The speed of the attackers right now. I love the momentum. They are definitely going for a speed record right now. Now, a lot of these hitters, it's also super, super late for them. And they also have Commander of the Month that they will be participating as well. And Clash fan, my real name is Gavin, buddy. G-A-V-I-N. Uh, but gaming alias, Skull Crusher. You know it. Okay, guys. Rika, 1-1-2. One, one, Going right back in for the Minotaur approach here. Nice job on the landing, guys. Flaring to the right. Reflaring to the left. I th Wow. I'm not sure if Rika did lose any Zookas on that landing, but that was very, very close. And I like that we've got Brick this time instead of Bullet, so you will not uh, be seeing the hero getting shocked and then the Zookas being reflared to the KZ. A nice job. No chances with that boom mine. Follows up with an artillery. Nice, guys. One smoke drop at the end here. I wish there were airplanes in Boom Beach, Clash fan. Reflare the core. What is up, Rudy? I love it, man. Cycle those shocks. One, two, three, four, and five! Holy crap, guys. Rika taking full advantage of those rocket launcher delay as well. And just like that, boom goes the dynamite. Following up with a smoke drop on those Zookas. I love it, guys. Rika, 1-1-12, putting on a clinic for us. Finishing off that 292 beast of a Manticore and getting it done. Thompson N. What is up, Thompson? Welcome to the live stream, my friend. We are doing All Hits Live with 25-man TF, Oz Domination, and I can't believe how fast this op is going. Wow. This is going fast.
fast. These guys are absolutely crushing it, man. And the Flash 32, absolutely loving it right now. Big Schmitty is loving it. Keep it going, guys. I might not be needed at the end. I doubt op will last an hour. I don't even think this op will come close to lasting an hour. Uh, round three of attempting to stream today, guys. We've only been going on 34 minutes and 30 seconds. We've got 13 attackers remaining with Cooker, Javanese, Manticore, and Titan remaining. These are absolute beasts of hitters putting on a clinic for us. And holy smokes, guys, we've got Arabic, sorry, Arabic friend going in next. I really have no idea who this is. So if somebody will be able to follow up with me in the YouTube chat as to who we are witnessing next here, uh, but I love it, guys. We are going right back into Titan here. Nice job. No need for a flare on the landing. Arabic is danger. That's danger. I love it, guys. Arabic, a.k.a. danger, stepping up to the plate next here. Oh, I thought he had a little bit of a gap there on his smoke. Playing it dangerous. I like it. Uh, he did Rika hit as well. Rika absolutely crushed it on the previous hit there, everybody. What a show that these hitters from Oz Dom are putting on. Now, not everyone here is from Oz Domination. This is an, an events all hits live, meaning that the attackers did sign up to participate in this. Uh, next with double cores. Uh, the only time that you are going to see double cores, my friend, is on duplexity. And unfortunately, I do not stream duplexity. Fritz, Fritz's army streams duplexity. You will definitely see some dual cores there. Oh my god, there is so much going on here. I think one of the rocket launchers, Danger, did forget the shock there. That is unfortunate because it did make very, very quick work of the Zookas. And there is so much going on in that very, very tight kill zone radius there, guys. You got machine guns, flamethrowers, cannons, and then of course rocket launchers and shock launchers firing as well. Let's go right back in there just so we can scout the top of that. That is a nasty, nasty Titan, everybody. Especially when you're using brick and making your way all the way up top, reflaring the core, core rushing Titan with brick. That is some serious skill right there. E, obviously, much easier to do with bullet. Uh, but guys, a very, very good attempt, a valiant effort right there from Danger. Show some love in the YouTube chat, guys. I can't believe how fast these bases are going down right now. Trying. Uh, but since we did get it up and going on the third time, third time's a charm. Dr. Kavon. Right now. And the reason why we've got... Absolutely crushing it. Now, I'm assuming... Hey, absolutely. Look at this, guys. We've got a... I'm hoping that, it, that we've got Dr. Kavon in here giving it a go. refresh refresh their stream right now because we should be back and up and going we've yet to see second win be activated but i think that's exactly yo and we've got crystal shield are you kidding me not even second wind everybody wow that's actually uh that's interesting let's give to keep pinning down the laser there he should be okay Grenz is still making quick work, and look at that, guys. The laser is officially down. I love it. I'm hoping, and you know what's crazy, too? Uh, it's only, um, I, I believe, my brother that is home right now as well. There's not even that many people home right now, meaning that the bandwidth and everything else should be okay right now. But we are still going with the attack. We're going to continue with the Grenz here. These guys are still chipping away. And I got to give you guys credit for sticking through me or sticking with me through the insanity, through the madness here. The connection just sucks today, guys. Absolutely awful. And we've got artillery bringing down those shield gens. Holy smokes, guys. Boom goes the dynamite on that one. Beauty. Uh, beauty of a hit. Uh, one sec before next attacker holy crap guys that was absolutely fantastic right there someone did curse us or 
as, where is it? As Hell's Queen says, poor skull, someone's siphoning your internet. I, I absolutely love that right there. Now it's letting me know that I've got no connection once again. I'm hoping that the next attacker does not step up to the plate next, guys. Ops looking toast. Fellas, we are absolutely crushing it. We are absolutely crushing it. Heck yeah, fellas. All right, so I'm just telling the fellas not to go in next. I want to make sure that the stream is still somewhat salvageable. And almost, almost, hold please. That's right, guys, hold please. Nobody jump in just yet. Uh, we don't need 25 hits. Okay, so you know what? We are going to progress. Next attacker, when ready, again, sincerest apologies on connection all right fellas looks like i i think we are okay right now anything is possible once again looking good looking better guys the stream is absolutely gone to hell and back uh, i'll be completely honest with you uh, about four or five times today uh with the first two attempts on the live stream actually cutting out so the oz domination fellas deserve much better than this. I do apologize, guys. I mean, what are we at? Friday, I've got Saturday, and then Sunday, uh, when I will be buying the parts to my PC, or at least once again, fingers crossed with all the setbacks, that's the date that's been set up with my friends Mark, with my friends Bathia, so anything is possible. And Hell's Queen, I, I, I love that. Poor Skull, someone is siphoning your internet. Damn neighbors and siphoning all that internet. I feel your pain, dude. I do. No worries, Fritz's army. Sometimes that's just the way she goes. And today, that's the way she's been going. B-Bag, right on, man. AL Tango, Josh, Hell's Queen, VA. Maybe the new phone seems like uh, the new phone is slipping. No way, man. This is definitely the connection today because my modem has crapped out about twice already today. A few people have mentioned that, that it very well could be the phone, Jeremy Jacobs. Uh, but I know for a fact that it is the internet uh, because it has cropped out twice already today. And VA, thank you so much for tuning in. Guys, show some love to VA, a.k.a. the devil. Guys, it is literally almost 4.20 a.m. Or sorry, 3.30 a.m. his time right now. Staying up, hitting live taking part in the operation absolutely spectacular show some love va thank you so much and guys we are jumping into the next attacker right now which is going to be tigger and fritz must be du recorder it was doing the same to me earlier well if it is du stream recorder fritz then du's got to get his stuff together all right guys let's jump right back into the madness here and appreciate tigger going in on titan uh oh whoa I think Tigger might have lost a handful of his Zookas right there because it looks like we don't have too many Zookas left. Thanks for being the one to get this started. Ads, no worries, man. I'm just sorry that it hasn't been as smooth, as smooth as I wanted it to be. Of course, nobody wants their stream to cut out three or four times. Ugh. Okay, guys, but let's focus back on Tigger here because he definitely, definitely deserves it. Nice. Reflaring the MG. Well, I love this. All the Zookas and Bullet get nicely inside. Reflare the core. Tigger's got to be really quick on his shocks here. One, two, three. Perfect shocks on the shock launchers and the rocket launchers. I don't know if Tigger has enough Zookas left to pack that punch. Or, considering so many of the Zookas were so close to bullet, there is still going to be that additional splash damage coming from the machine guns there. Still a valiant effort from Tigger there. Guys, boom goes the dynamite. Show some love. I can't believe this, guys. Cooker, Javanese, Manticore, and Titan. Only bases remaining right now. The fellas that signed up for this event have been absolutely crushing it. 100%. Ah, stupid MG. 
And we've got Angry Big Ben going in for Manti. Now, I'm wondering if Angry Big Ben is going to go for the right side approach or if Angry Big Ben is going to go directly right up the middle here. Once again, guys, anything is possible. Fingers crossed. Let's take a look at the insanity, the madness. And just from looking at the flare points here, Angry Big Ben will be going directly up the middle here. As cool as it would be to see a right side approach again, not going to happen right now, guys. We are definitely going up the middle here. Reflare directly in front of the two mortars. First mid flare point. Keeping the flares tight, guys. I like it. We've got the next mid flare point going directly above the mortars. And from here, guys, we should see a direct reflare to the left of the Building Health Masterpiece. And there it is. Look at that path, perfectly cleared. Hey there, angry Big Ben, says Thompson. Beautiful two smoke drop at the end here. Guys, we are gonna zoom out here as far as we can. Reflare to the cord. Let's see those critters to the left and to the right here. There they are, to the right, to the left. Cycling the shocks. Come on, Zookas. Come on, Zookas. Oh, no. It looked like some of the rocket launchers were targeting the Zookas after the critters were thrown. That is very unfortunate, guys. That was still a valiant, valiant effort right there. Show some love. Big shout out to Angry Big Ben right there, giving us a valiant effort there on Manticore, guys. And we still have nine hitters remaining with Titan, Javanes, and Manticore, literally all one hitters, which theoretically speaking should leave us with approximately five or six hits to bring down Cooker. This is going to be awesome, man. Uh, Jimmy around. Ugh, late on second critters, man. That was still an awesome attack, man. Let's make sure we spell it right. Valiant effort. Yeah, man. Uh-oh. No time to waste. Oh, is this B-22 bomber? And yes, yes, it is B-22 bomber. Guys, I've actually got some really, really good news for you. Um, this is B-22 bomber's very first all hits live. So for everybody watching right now, guys, I got 25 people in the YouTube chat right now. Do not forget to show some love to B-22 Bomber, guys. Big hype, big shout out. And I'm not sure if the sh if uh, if he realizes that there's a couple shield gens still on. Needs to get those shield gens. I think everybody else, shield gen rush. Don't rush, 50's like, don't rush. Uh-oh. Uh, B-22 Bomber going in for his very first All Hits Live. Taking on the core with two shield gens remaining. I love the confidence here. I love it, guys. I am awful at the Cooker Core Rush. The pressure is real, Fritz. Whoa, look at that light show. And I think it's at this point, B-22 Bomber realized that the shield gens are still up. But guys, you almost had two consecutive light shows firing at once there on the Scorcher. That was really, really cool. I'm wondering who's going to brave and be the brave one uh, to let B-22 Bomber know that the shields first, left shields first, uh, says Boss, uh, sorry, Boss Beach. I love that. Going back to the YouTube comments, everybody. Hell's Queen is loving it. Ha ha ha, shield gen rush. Corporal GG, what is up, man? Welcome to live stream. Big shout out to the great baboons. Happy you can join us, Corporal. Show some love. Thompson N. Go Bomber. Or sorry, he must have missed that. He, you know what? Accidentally, he clearly did miss it. But guys, we've got TT James. TT going in for Cooker round two. And this time, we are not going to miss those shield gens, everybody. Ah, this is awesome, guys. We almost had... A cooker shield gen rush here. Once again, guys, 28 people in the YouTube chat. Thank you so much for hanging out with me, for showing the support. I do sincerely apologize for the very rough start with regards to the technical difficulties. But guys, we were sticking with it. We were going to fight through it. And Vanessa Vasquez, still a good hit. 100% agree with you. That was an amazing hit. 
And now we've got TT, James, TT, going in for the cleanup here. Now, uh, the shock placement on the Scorcher on the previous hit was on point, everybody. Excellent job. Unfortunately, a few Zookas might have been caught up in that madness, but still a very, very good job, everybody. So we've got the Scorcher and Brick yet again here. We're going to get that Battle Orders fired off. Nice job flaring up top. Now, since that Shock Mine is not there anymore, TT James TT will have to rely on using his own Shock to pin down his Scorcher. Excellent job. Quick on that reflare. From this point, reflare the core. If you bullet, it will come, Skull. Look at that light show, everybody. Beautiful light show. Zooka's out of harm's way. You got all those lasers targeting that Scorcher. And just like that, TT, James, TT, finishing off 260. Cooker, boom, goes the dynamite. Guys, that was absolutely savage right there. Do not forget to drop that exclamation mark. Boom. Show some love to Mr. TT, James, TT, finishing off Cooker. That's what I'm talking about, guys. Seven, uh, sorry, seven attackers remaining. We've got Javanese, we've got Titan, and we've got Manticore. Holy crap, everybody. And 50. If you built it, they will come. You know what? If you bullet, they will always come. 50. Absolutely, man. Clash Fan Netherlands, if you click on the clock, Vanna Flare Medkit, uh, the color chance, I hope you understand me. The color changes, yes. I do know what you're talking about, buddy. Absolutely. Robots, man, what's up, buddy? Welcome to the live stream. And Clash Fan going boom as well. And thank you so much, man. Looking fresh, looking fly. Sometimes we take the hat off and show the natural beauty. Appreciate the kind words, man. Hit whatever you like, guys. We've got the next attacker, Sniper, going into Javanese here. This is going to be exciting. These bases are so close to going down, guys. Now, it would have been nice to roll a green court, to roll a red line, even a hard core, to be honest with you. Um, but I think this has been a very, very easy forlorn hope operation roll. I want this FH and Home Task Force some time. No kidding, Josh. I think everybody watching this is going, why can't we get FH like this? Holy crap, guys. Nice job bunching up bullet, bullet, yikes, brick, and the Zookas. Sniper, I think, is going to bring this down, guys. Absolutely bring this down, man. So we've got bullet and the Zookas getting into position here. Nicely done here. Now, he's got to be careful here because the Zookas have already hit a mine. Nice. Two smoke drop at the end here. Whoa! Premature battle orders. Ah! Premature battle orders. Okay, Sniper. Recover. You got this. Cycle those shocks. One, two, and three. One more battle orders. Wait for it. One more battle orders and the critter box. Boom goes the dynamite, guys. Absolutely savage right there. Show some love. Guys, we just witnessed a premature battle orders. Makes two of us, LOL. One shield gen base. You know what? A one shield gen base on an FH roll? Yeah, right, man. Robots, man. Guys, hit that like button. 28 of y'all are watching, and there's only 10 likes. Let's get skull to 20. All oh, robots, man, it is still early, man. My streams still generally get more likes after I'm done streaming as well, but I appreciate the love and support, buddy. Big shout out to you, robots, man. And holy crap, guys. Sniper with the premature battle orders but still getting the boom goes the dynamite still six hitters remaining and we've got manticore and we've got titan hanging on by a thread man major azul i just rolled a six shield gen forlorn in commander of the month that is awful by the way best of luck in commander of the month hit the adrenaline from this is absolutely insane enjoy guys i gotta get back to work thompson n Thank you for taking some time off work, popping in, hanging out with us, man. We are going to be successful in bringing down FH here. It's just a matter of how many hitters will be remaining, man. 
and robots man no problem buddy i'm gonna leave i just wanted to join i'll join later when i can absolutely robots man have yourself a great night thank you for tuning in man and i will definitely talk to you later man big shout out to robots man five four six seven ads lol major should be a hard one to judge then holy crap corporal gg showing the love to thompson as well let josh hit something so two serial killers here blinky all right guys we've got the next attacker going in angry star going in for titan now remember this is a nasty titan with so many machine guns up front but with perfect shocks and bullet as well i think we can definitely definitely be able to pull this one through so we're just waiting for this to spectate and actually get through to the actual viewing of the attack here robots man buddy i also dropped a like i also made a few more alts uh since i last uh huge raid to you uh so it should get you closer to that 1.k oh uh, no worries robots man appreciate all the love and support you have been giving man okay guys let's get back to angry stars attack here going right up the middle here beautiful man look at this go and is it just me or does it seem like the troops are moving at a little bit of a quicker pace It's almost like a speed serum has been injected into them already. But that is not the case, everybody. Tur L. Yo, Skull. Just dropping in for a bit. Gotta get to work soon, though. We'll catch up later. No worries, guys. We've got a Tur L sighting in the YouTube chat. Show some love, everybody. Tur L. We've had some phenomenal hits so far. Whoa. Delay has been lost. I repeat, Angry Star has lost the delay. Whoa, those rocket launchers just ripped those Zookas a new one. Okay, we've got a direct reflare on the furthest MG here. Let's get all those Zookas into position. Nicely done. Reflare the core. Wait for it. Oh my god. Missed a couple of the rocket launchers. But just like that, boom goes the dynamite. Wow, maybe maybe we should have rolled a sixth uh, shield gen base uh, forlorn hope. Uh, one shield gen base adds, and look at that angry star. Boom goes the dynamite going in, dropping Titan like a boss. And we've got three fifteen Manticore left with five hitters remaining and robots man i'm at 1.1k but i keep going down below it lol rip uh no worries robots man there's always going to be the trollers that get you up get you down get you up and get you down to stay consistent bro keep doing your thing and you will get to that 1.1 and so will i but guys what a great hit right there corporal gg showing the love to turrell dropping a boom as well clash fan dropping a boom guys we've got ben in the YouTube chat, or should I say Zed Ben Musa? What is up, Zed, aka Ben Zayad Zed Zayad? Eh, that's why I just stick with Ben. Welcome to the live stream. Show some love, guys. We've got a Ben sighting, Tur L showing the love to Corporal, and adds time to play. Save the core on a nearly dead Manti. Save the core. L O L. This. Up was a joke. You fellas are base. And you know what? Even like that, we still have an attacker going in right now. Scott going in on Manticore. Guys, this is definitely going to have to be save the core right now. Save the core, save the core, save the core. Clash fan dropping a skull crusher command. My man. Now, if you drop it with it's just being skull, you might get a better result there, my friend. And look at these fellas go. We may be going for save the core right now. Can Gred that whole left side? I might actually pop in with Grens, man. Absolutely. Okay, guys. So we've got Captain Everspark dropping that first hack. You know what? That is unfortunate. She did go down. She did go down, but she was successful in firing that hack off on the rocket launcher. Still dropping eight boats of Zookas right up front. Josh R. Scott is longtime leader of all Oz domination for years. Played since almost day one. You know what? I got to give credit to the Oz domination boomers. Very cool, man. Josh R. 50 mans, 25s, all of them. Corporal GG wishing a perfect and a, a sorry, not a, a terrific. Was that terrific? I hope you have a super terrific day. That is awesome. And guys, Scott going in like a boss right now. Uh, we are officially saving the core right now. So guys, be honest with me. And I, I'm serious. Be honest. 
How many of you in your TFs get down and play Forlorn Hope and find yourselves saving the core because you've got five or six attackers remaining and a Manticore hanging on by a thread, man. Look at this guy go. Absolutely crushing it right now. 50, man. 25s all the time. Scott is longtime leader. That's the command right there. And Robots, man. What a funny is when I first saw your channel, you were like 100 more subs ahead of me. Uh, but it's like a pattern of you being higher than me, uh, being higher than you, LOL, you being higher than me soon. Uh, just the way YouTube works, man. Some days we're going to have great days and get many subs. Uh, then we're going to have many days and not get any subs. Uh, it's the nature of the beast, Robots Man, and the way she goes. But yeah, man, I am absolutely thrilled uh, for hitting 1,100 subscribers, pushing a 1.5, pushing a 2K, and then holy crap, man, sky's the limit. So yeah, absolutely, guys. If we do have any newer viewers watching this right now and you are enjoying and like the content do not forget to support the channel by clicking that subscribe button and of course ringing that bell scott still going sparky is down and out but making the most of this farm right now and we are just very slowly watching that health bar go down and down and down very nicely done by scott Big shout out to Oz Domination, guys. Heavy speed. Yep, just blow some stuff up on the left side. Big Schmitty is like, I'm here, man. Yes, Joss. Heavies for rush. Guys, we might actually be setting up an all heavy core rush here. Oh, you guys are hilarious. We don't play for loan. Never save, always just kill it. HQ? I love it, 100%, man. And I'm really glad you keep growing and your content is still staying amazing even though you keep growing. Well, that's awesome, Robots, man. Shout out to you as well, buddy. And of course, stay loyal, man. Find your niche and stick with it. Whoa, man, we have got a final barrage and artillery going down on those mortars. Still one Zooka remaining, guys. We are officially hashtag save the core Four hitters remaining. This is incredible right now. Hashtag save the core. LOL. And this is saving the core on Forlorn Hope right now, guys. So we did actually have the first attack on the first part of the live stream before it did cut out. But then we streamed up round two. Just as much technical difficulties. And it looks like so far for the third stream, everything's been... A lot smoother. I'm not going to say perfect, everybody, uh, but it's definitely been a lot smoother, and I'm liking this synergy, the dedication of these hitters. And guys, we are moments away from dropping Forlorn Hope Live. So shout out to Oz Domination, to Josh, to Ads, to VA for making this happen. More up than down for sure. I love it, HQ. Did you know that by duplexity, there are super mortars? I don't think there are super mortars on duplexity, are there? And robots, man, I think I joined at 600 subs also. When you get famous, remember me. Absolutely, buddy. Oh, you, you're too awesome, man. Thank you so much, man. And guys, do a heavy rush. I think these guys are actually trying to figure out what troops they're going to be using for the core rush. So I think I still have to set myself up accordingly here. I'm going to load up a 1-7 tanks, grenadiers, and bullet. Now remember, guys, I'm still patient, and I am still waiting for my turn. So in the meantime, we might as well turn another statue here. Uh, Okie dokie, like vid of you blindfold running a heavy core rush. That's what we need to see. Boss Beach, blow core, then Bart your Zookas for doing so. Hit, rush the core with heavies, plus play blindfolded. I love these guys. They're just trying to come up with very um, extravagant ways to finish this off, guys. But we've got Big Schmitty, Josh R, Ads, and then yes, if it's still, I repeat, if it's still remaining, 
we've got Skull Crusher as well. Very exciting, guys. Yep, go for it. Go, go, hit it. I think we're just waiting for um, Big Schmitty to go in. Rush the core with heavies. Big Schmitty, Josh R, Skull, and adds. So 50, we've got approximately... We do have approximately 207,322 hit points left on that power core. Ah, Big Schmitty, another longtime Oz Dom figure playing since day one. Ben's absolutely busting a gut in the comments right now. Rush the core with Cryoneers. If anyone is actually brave enough to do that, they may actually... So Big Schmitty, another longtime Oz Domination figure playing since day one. That is awesome, man. Big shout out to Oz Domination. And of course, the Big Schmitty as well. And finally, we've got the attacker going in here. Big Schmitty is going to be doing a Manticore Core Rush with heavies. Now, Ben, if I'm not the last attacker, I will go in with all cryos. Uh, I'll rush with cryos, but probably be dead before I get there. So guys, we are attempting an all-heavy core rush to bring down Manticore right now. This is so cool. How many times do you guys get the chance to see Manticore go down with an all-heavy core rush? Guys, can I get a hashtag? Boom! Goes the heavies. Very cool. Making our way up top now. Excellent, guys. We've got the heavies in position. Almirante Mata. Any more all hits live later on? Shocking early. Not even dropping critters. Oh, he is dropping critters. Yo, he is core rushing with heavies. That was brilliant, guys. I, I'm wondering if Big Schmitty did drop his critters a little bit earlier. Because remember, guys, critters first, shock second. Uh, Big Schmitty did shock first and critter second. So still three hitters remaining. Uh, we've got Josh R going up next. I love this, man. Prob didn't even need the critters. L-M-A-O, L-O-L. That did nearly 100k damage. So we've got Josh R now. Going in next on Manticore with the heavy core rush. Which means if we are heavy core rushing this to the end, guys, I may load up heavies for myself and attempt the heavy core rush. But I got to give Josh R credit here, guys. Look how fast these heavies are going. Oh, heavy speed. I was like, we've definitely got heavy speed in the mix here. So you are actually seeing heavies and heavy speed being applied to high level operations here look at that four smoke drop at the end here reflaring the core he's gonna get it man yo he is gonna get it critter box drops the shocks absolutely crushing it with the all heavy core rush Brick is down and out, and guys, we've actually got two attackers remaining, which means we have just successfully defeated Forlorn Hope live in 23 attacks. Can I get a boom goes the dynamite, guys? That was incredible right there. Skull Crusher not even getting a chance to hit here, and Fate insomniacs what is up fate insomniacs that's a first absolutely loving it as well big big shout out to you fate insomniacs absolutely man i don't think you're gonna see heavies going for a manticore core rush on forlorn hope that was absolutely beautiful guys clash fan i'm so sorry you got the wind being absolutely crazy for you right now ads i can honestly say i have never seen an all heavy rush on any op, let alone, sorry, let alone forlorn hope. 
Guys, that's right. You just witnessed the all-heavy core rush right there. Fate Insomniax is loving it. And Major Azul, yet another Forlorn Hope goes down on yet another All Hits Live Skull. Yo, we've got a thing going on now, Major, with regards to dropping Forlorn Hope live. I love it, man. Clash fan, I, uh, the wind here is heavy. I hear a piece of wood hit my window. That's awful, man. Oz Domination All Hits Live event. That was tough with the heavy speed try, man. All heavies is the new meta. Yo, somebody let Shishkabobber know. That is absolutely incredible. I've got to let the fellas know that was insane. That was insane. We dropped FH Live. And in less than 25 attacks. Guys, you got to show some love to the hitters right now who actually made this a reality right now. So guys, honestly, going down from the bottom right here, big, big, big shout out to Boss Beach, to Devil, to Sacco Varmint, to Base Beach, to Sir Brown, aka Jordy, Jordy, I'm sorry, Major Azul, Captain 50, Ultron, Andy, Zombie Pigman, Ninja Turtle, Rika 112, I think this one is Andy as well, 92 ads, Tigger, Angry Big Ben, B22 Bomber, TT, James, TT, Sniper, Angry Star, Scott, Big Schmitty, and Josh R. Guys, we just crushed FH Live in 23 attacks in one hour and 37 minutes with using heavies to finish off the core rush. So for anyone just tuning in right now, guys, before we do actually wrap things up, yes, you just witnessed an all heavy core rush. Silvio Santos, boy, not to, oh, I can't even pronounce that. I'm so sorry. Silvio Santos, thank you so much for the kind words. Right on, robots, man. I'll definitely be checking Telegram after. 50, thank you so much, man. Josh R., Thanks to everyone for hitting and Skull for streaming. We'll do it again when Intel is full. And you know what, guys? Once again, I want to thank you all so much for your patience, for your commitment to the stream with regards to the technical difficulties that we did have getting this stream up and going. Yes, I realized the stream went to hell, and it went to hell about three or four times, but we persisted. We stayed on top of it, and we crushed Forlorn Hope live. One hour, 37 minutes, 23 attacks, Oz domination, all hits live special. Now, this was an event, meaning that the hitters did have to sign up for this. So once again, big shout out to Oz domination, to Ads, to Josh, and to VA. Josh, thank you as well. One hour, 37 minutes, including YouTube. Technical difficulties. I love it, ads. Josh R., yup. Zombie Pigman. Global erection. Eruption. <laughs> Zombie Pigman. Global eruption. Thanks for the stream, Skull. Thank you, ZPM. Oh my god, guys. 50. Thanks, Team Oz Dom. Maybe easiest FH I've ever seen. Bays Beach. We strong at Oz Dom. Yo, Bays. That should be the model right there. We strong at Oz Dom. And Skull for time and entertainment. Thank you, 50. Absolutely, man. I'm just happy that we got things up and going after the technical difficulties. Clash fan, cool, awesome attacks. Fairs, thank you, Fairs. Thank you for tuning in, and I hope you have a great night, guys. Big shout out to Fairs. Clash fan is like awesome. Way to save the stream. Bay's Beach, way for you guys to stick with me to save the stream. Zookasaurus Rex, I missed the stream, but hope you all enjoy the day. Guys, big shout out to Zookasaurus Rex. Absolutely, man. Awesome Oz domination. Corporal GG's like awesome as well. Guys, holy crap, we did it. And here is the TF again. Oz domination, all hits live with Skull Crusher, Forlorn Hope, full boosted, Friday, February the 8th, 2019 at 4 p.m. United States Eastern Standard Time. Contact at Josh R. 
underscore Ozdom on Telegram. And remember, guys, if you have not downloaded Telegram already, get on it, guys. And you also want to make sure you join the official OG Boomers Telegram room. One second, guys, just setting this up accordingly. So I want to thank you all so much for tuning in. One second, OG Boomers. Awesome, guys. Once again, shout out to Ads, to Josh, and to VA for making this a reality, guys. I'm going to thank everybody so much. Thank you all so much. Guys, once again, dropping FH live in one hour and 37 minutes. Oz Domination. Great TF, guys. So happy to partake and to stream it. And we will officially be wrapping up the live stream. Clash fan, awesome. It's an emote skull. That is a really, really cool emote, buddy. Thank you so much. Guys, once again, thank you all so much for tuning in to the 25-man Oz Domination All Hits Live event taking on Forlorn Hope, not only beating it in one hour and 37 minutes, but beating it with technical difficulty after technical difficulty after technical difficulty. So thank you all so much for sticking with me. Hell's Queen, right back at you. Respect the E, Elite Force forever. Oz Domination, you guys are awesome. To the homies down under, keep on booming. Guys, we will officially be wrapping up the live stream. We are going to make it like a Tom and Cruise. Have a good night, everyone. Peace!